So, in terms of myself, basically, this week I finished um, Marvel Spider Man on PlayStation 4. Though I did play on my PlayStation 5, it looks amazing on PlayStation 5. And it was really, really fun. So I had a lot of fun with it. So check out the playthrough on my Let's Play channel. And I'm now starting my adventures through Resident Evil 7 because Resident Evil Village is coming out in on the 7th of May. So in about like three weeks from now, I guess. So I thought this is the time for me to get back into Resident Evil. Now, fasting started this week for me. So what fasting is basically is during the Islamic month of Ramadan or Ramadan, however you want to pronounce it. And basically during the month, uh, Muslims observe fasting between sunrise to sunset. And at this point of time, given that it's um, mid-April, um, that means from something like 3.30 in the morning till nearly 8 p.m. at night, no food, no water, and no many other things, basically no nothing. <laughs> so, and outside of the hours, you can do what you like. And traditionally, what we tend to do is we have a biggish dinner, and then we will just have lots of water in the evening. And then some people do get up just before sunrise uh, to have a like breakfast, but I can't eat after midnight, otherwise I would just it won't end well, let's just say. And I've been doing this every year since I was eight years old. And I am now 36. So, and it can have a profound effect on me. So last couple of years, it was okay. But three years ago, it was devastating for my health. Like I, I felt sick for probably four months after the fasting finished. But those of you who know me know that three years ago, I wasn't going through a pleasant time in my life. But something that's helped me a lot, which I did mention in some of my other videos, is I'm taking these uh, multivitamins so that they're keeping me um, alive in every way. They have like 26 vitamins and minerals for me to have every day. And I take cod liver oil as well. Obviously, this is not health advice. This is just what I'm doing. Now... Um, the reason I do it is because um, I, I try not to um, talk about religion too much um, because, let's be honest, it can lead to a lot of issues online. Uh, but anyone who knows me knows that I am Muslim. So, um, yeah, but let's not get into it. I'm not, you know, I'm not here to justify my religion. I'm not here to convert anyone. I'm not here to anything. I'm just saying this is what I do. So um, that's, that's that. And generally, I'm sick of my routine. So I'm doing everything I can do. But with the fasting, you know, obviously, if you're eating less and you so on, and like you'll basically, it's effectively intermittent fasting, let's be honest, for like 20 hours a day, um, it can lead to you feeling completely diminished. So I am doing my best to just push through it and keep all the routine going. So I have six YouTube channels, I have my Instagram page that I'm posting to every day, and so on. And any interesting tweets, I retweet them, and things like that. And um, I am now trying to pay more attention to my Instagram. My Instagram has always been neglected for me. So I am trying my best now to post to it regularly. And what I'm doing on there, actually, is I'm posting like one, two minutes gaming news. So do check out the gaming news videos. Yes, anything interesting in gaming, um, I post on there. And then two interesting games, which I've played in the past, which I absolutely loved. So um, what I'm hoping over time, as time goes on, that my Instagram feed will just become a library of amazing games in case you ever need ideas of games to play. Simple as that. And um, other than that, I'm... I'm good, I'm relaxed, ill, because, you know, I'm still debt free, thank God, I've been able to maintain, and you can see updates on my personal finance channel about um, how things are going that, in that regard, and um, I'm trying my best to just live a normal life, simple as that, so, um, basically, um, during the next three weeks, basically, you're, you're probably going to see my my smile go down and down and down. 
but that's just because of diminished energy. But once the fasting is finished, then it's gone for another year. So basically I can get back to normal because I was having a hell of a time when um, I was really, really getting into my routine. Like I was waking up early, I was having breakfast, I would work for a couple of hours, I would have a nice lunch and then I just live stream for the rest of the day. I think for me that's a perfect routine and it's a, it's a good routine I can maintain seven days a week, simple as that. So um, like, let me know as well in those comments, are you fasting, how does it make you feel? Like during the first week to be honest it doesn't have that much effect. What tends to happen for me is the first week sort of getting into it, the second week I'll feel Ugh. then the third week I'll start recovering and then usually by the end I get so into the routine I feel like I'm going to miss it when it when it's over. But obviously when it is over then I'm I'm obviously happy. So um that's traditionally the way things go for me. And um that's the effect it can have on everything else that I'm doing. So um if there's any day where I just fe don't feel up to it, don't feel up to the live stream on, I will take the day off. Like I always um as I've said many times, I always prioritize my health above everything else. So if fasting causes me to feel too tired or too whatever, too weak, then I will just take the day off and just relax. And I'm trying to sleep more as well. Like um, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to push it. And one thing I was trying to do on the live stream, for example, I was trying to stand up for at least half an hour every day during the live stream to strengthen my legs. But I can't do that right now because I can't drink. So it's, it's obviously a dangerous game to do any sort of exercise when you can't hydrate. So, um, but again, once the fasting is finished, hopefully we will get back into it. So, like I said, let me know in those comments, how does fasting make you feel if you fast? It doesn't have to be even for religious reasons. It can be for just intermittent fasting for health reasons. Um, and also as well, like what games are you looking forward to? Because I think on the 23rd, so in a week, so in less than a week, we have near replicant and 30th we have returnal then 7th of may we have resident evil village but we have a lot of games coming um in the next two three weeks so and i i don't know which ones of those i'm going to check out maybe i'll check out all of them maybe i'll check out just one just resident evil but we'll see um so let me know your thoughts and feelings in the comments below and yeah that's it for my weekly update. So anyway, guys, I've linked two other videos to this video. This is my weekly vlog channel. So every Sunday I will post an update about my life and everything that's going on. Um, and if you want to check out previous episodes, feel free to click any of the links. Otherwise, I will see you next week.